have to be one of my personal favorite genres. I don't know what it is about them, but the resource management crossed with the building, crossed with the running of the city, is just the perfect mix of engaging, fun, and frustrating. In this video, we'll be going through 10 amazing city builders, ranging from nice and cozy all the way to dystopian apocalypse. Featuring amazing indie games is something we do regularly here at the Indie Brew, so make sure to subscribe for more indie game content. Without further ado, let's dive into some epic city builder games. Establish a city in a post-apocalyptic world in the industry-focused city builder, New Cycle. You'll need to take care of your people's basic needs, distributing food, water, tools, and clothes, whilst managing their work schedules and entertainment and medical needs. You'll build your city from scratch with both freeform and grid-based building, and resource collection will be paramount, so you'll need to establish plenty of the various types of resource buildings and staff them appropriately to survive. Your colony exists in an unforgiving world, so you'll need to navigate various natural disasters, but that won't be the only thing that poses a threat to your growing settlement. You'll need to carefully manage crises, unrest, and other challenges that pose a threat to your colony, with your choices influencing your colony's success. This is a darker city builder with steampunk vibes and complex resource management, and is a great choice for those who love a challenging city builder. In this futuristic western themed city builder, you'll land on Earth and attempt to establish a new colony on the planet again. There's only one problem. The planet is dying. You'll build housing, production buildings, and more to keep your settlement growing and your bot colony happy. Each class of bot requires certain things before they'll move in, so you'll need to ensure you're servicing them with all they require to function. Grow your workforce so you can head underneath the ground to harvest resource and attempt to find some lost ancient tech. You'll need to fight off waves of creepy crawlies that attack your tech underground, utilizing some tower defense elements to keep your equipment and your bots safe. This is a root and toot in addition to the city builder space that combines futuristic elements with the wild west and is a great choice for the budding city builder. Rebuild civilization in the face of apocalyptic rains in the dark fantasy city builder against the storm. Taking a fantasy spin on a colony sim, your constituents will be made up of humans, as well as beavers, lizards, foxes, and harpies, with each having their own unique needs and skill set. You'll experience a shrouded map and you'll need to chop your way through to uncover what lies in each shrouded blade and deal with the sometimes deadly conflict. Complete tasks to satisfy the queen, building resource collection buildings and production buildings to fulfill the quests, while ensuring your flame is protected from the brutal storms. You won't just build one city in this game, but instead you'll progress through a roguelite map, building up cities in a range of different locations that each pose different challenges as you reclaim the world. This is a great fantasy city builder for those who love a bit of dark magic in their game. Build the ultimate city for beavers in the colony sim Timberborn. In a world struck by droughts and toxic waste, you'll establish a beaver colony. Paying careful attention to managing your food and water, as when the droughts hit, your colony will only survive if you're adequately prepared. Not only will you be able to build the usual housing and resource buildings, but in Timberborn, you're also able to do some terraforming too, building dams, blowing up embankments, and shaping the land to your will to protect your colony. This one has some unique vertical architecture that allows you to build a true city from the ground up, creating a really interesting city building environment. You'll need to ensure the bad water doesn't hit your settlement and keep your beavers happy in this challenging yet adorable city builder game. If you're looking for a cozy city builder, then look no further than Fabledom. In this fantasy, fairy tale inspired game, you'll build up your own kingdom complete with champions, dragons, and giants to contend with. Your Fablings will all need adequate housing before setting them to work, gathering resources to keep your kingdom fed, and allow you to expand. City management is not the only thing you'll have on your mind, as in this game you can also find true love for yourself as you form relationships with your neighbouring kingdoms. With an adorably magical aesthetic, this is a game that's full of enchanting fun and is perfect for the cosy game. Build a thriving community on untamed land in Pioneers of Begonia. You'll make land on a mysterious island and you'll need to quickly establish a settlement, prioritizing resource production as you establish your colony. You'll gradually explore the untamed land around you, coming up against bandits and other colonies as you grow your pioneer community and you'll need to ensure you grow an army capable of protecting your settlement. This one has a ton of different buildings you can construct with over 50 different buildings and more than 80 goods to be produced in different production trains. This one also has co-op functionality and procedurally generated maps. So this one is a great complex management sim with a heavy resource focus that is perfect for the city builder lover. In this charming settlement builder game, you'll take on the role of a leader delegated to build new settlements in remote corners of the empire. With a realistic 
optimistic seasonal cycle, you need to ensure your food production is adequate, lest your villagers starve in the winter. Balancing growing your settlement with the impact your growth has on the environment around you will pose a challenge, as all living things in this game seek to find their place in nature. With a vibrant world environment and some really thorough speed options, this is truly a game you can enjoy at your own pace. This is a great city builder for those who love a heavy simulation focus and is a really great laid back choice. Enter a ruthless world where the rival powers of the Caribbean fight for power and control in Republic of Pirates. Set in the golden age of piracy, you'll build a resource-based economy as you establish settlements on different islands throughout the Caribbean. Ensure your settlement has everything it needs to thrive, producing different resources and scavenging them from shipwrecks as you reclaim your father's legacy. You'll need to utilize the black market to distribute valuable resources and recruit the best captains to sail your newly constructed ships as you navigate through the cutthroat world, taking out any who stand in your way. With some choices matter moments that allow you to shape your destiny and some real-time naval combat to spice things up too, this is a great action choice for the city builder lover. Rule the last city on earth in the survival city builder, Frostpunk. In this dark colony sim game, you'll need to manage both the citizens and the infrastructure as the world is completely frozen and heat is your key to survival. This is a game that experiments with shaping society itself and you'll be able to create laws and make some morally gray decisions to allow your city to survive. With a frostland to explore, the weather will be your greatest challenge in this intense colony sim game, and you'll have a range of different maps to choose where you'll make your last stand. Will you be able to make the necessary choices to survive? Build up a fortress on the Great Ursi in the sandbox city builder Bulwark Balcony Chronicle. In this naval themed city builder, your main focus will be designing an epic island fortress with a side of exploration, management and strategy element. The resource system in the game functions on distance, not cost, allowing you to have greater creative freedom while still needing to keep resource collection in mind. Exploring the ocean will see you uncover refugees, new ships to recruit to your fleet, and colonies that are allied with various factions. Choose whether to turn these factions into enemies or allies, unlocking more as you progress through the game. This is an interesting take on a city builder that really focuses on the building and exploration rather than management, and it's a great choice for those who prefer a more sandbox experience. That is a wrap on some amazing city builder games. I'd love to know your faves in this genre, so let me know yours in the comments below. Click here for more indie game recommendations and until next time, stay caffeinated.